Columbo has emerged back into Fortnite and he's better than ever. In this video, we are looking at everything new in season two that you guys don't want to miss. Desert Columbo is in Fortnite, but before we can find him, we gotta check this out. In a super recent video, we talked about leaks of Darth Vader coming to our Fortnite game. This is still true. But we did talk about in season three how Jones is coming to the game and this. <laughs> no, this is wrong. Oh, but not Agent Jones, no. But Indiana Jones! Indiana Jones is coming to our Fortnite game in Season 3. And it has everything to do with Desert Columbo in our Fortnite game. We talked about how Epic Games accidentally released information about Season 3 during a live event in which they showed off the engine of Fortnite. The coding here, C3S3 Jones, has now been confirmed completely to be Indiana Jones. And no, not Agent Jones. Players have been suspecting that an Indiana Jones collaboration would soon be coming to the game. It would seem like now it is officially happening. But we know this is a hundred percent happening because one of Fortnite's biggest leakers, Tabor Hill, who actually has an inside source at Epic Games, has actually confirmed that this is true. I mean, get a load of this. Jones, in fact, is Indiana Jones. Darth Vader and Indiana Jones are coming to Chapter 3, Season 3. But this is Indiana Jones. It's not a snapshot of Agent Jonesy. It's not another Jonesy skin. It's, in fact, Indiana Jones. Oh, there you have it. Before long, we will be playing as Indiana Jones, exploring caves, you know, a little bit like this, and finding deep treasure hidden inside. Oh, those eggs. What the heck are chocolate eggs huh? doing here? And how have they not melted in the sun? Hey, listen, I'm just playing. I know it's Easter. And I know chocolate doesn't melt in Fortnite, but, uh... Girl, hold on a second. Oh, but what is this gonna do with Desert Columbo? <laughs> well, check this out. Oh, well, it turns out our new Columbo actually already has something to do with this Indiana Jones collaboration. Yeah. Oh, first thing we gotta do is just find Columbo. Oh, we already know a brand new version of Columbo is gonna be coming to Fortnite, Columbo 2.0, because of uncovered coding, suggesting that a sand mound is soon to appear in our game. You know those snow piles that have appeared in Fortnite recently? Yes, that's right, the same snow piles that were used to introduce Columbo all the way back in chapter 3. While we know the snow pilots have made their way to our Fortnite game, but where is the dirt mound? And where's the sand mound? The snow one is currently in game. The desert one should appear any time now. And I don't know about you, there is only one place where a desert pile is really gonna spawn, and that's right here. Oh my goodness, yo, what the heck happened over there? Okay, you're right, we already know this, but now as knowing that Indiana Jones is coming to our Fortnite game, somebody that raids tombs in the ancient Egyptian Egyptian deserts, we could probably suspect that the Indiana Jones collaboration and potential boss is gonna arrive in the same desert locations as Columbo. Is it actually possible that the desert pile that is soon going to be releasing Columbo 2.0 is gonna arrive at the same time that our Fortnite game introduces Indiana Jones? Maybe boss Columbo 2.0 will be discovered in the desert during some kind of Indiana Jones quest? Or maybe Indiana Jones himself is somehow gonna utilize Columbo 2.0? But we shouldn't get too carried away because we're not gonna know until the actual collaboration comes out. Oh, snap. Yo, what the heck is down here, bro? Oh, whoa, what? Yo, why's my man's got so many cars, bro? What's going on down here? Oh, hold on. Hold that thought about Columbo. And now think about this Columbo thought. I actually found out recently that this location with a bunch of cars is actually the same location where players tried to actually defeat Columbo in Chapter 3. Apparently, when there was this big trend where everybody was trying to eliminate Columbo, a bunch of players tried to blow him up with cars. So it would seem that the games has added a Columbo Easter egg in the desert. Maybe this whole Columbo desert Indiana Jones thing is actually going to happen. We're on to you, Epic. And the storm is on to me. What a surprise. I guess I better leave this fun secret Easter egg alone, huh? Jeez, man. Is Desert Columbo 2.0 going to be included with the Indiana Jones collaboration? Is Desert Columbo going to be an Egyptian beast rising out of the desert sand in a new upcoming update? Well, there's a lot of fun ideas, but we're just gonna have to wait and see. I am not waiting to get out of this storm, bro. I am over it. Out of the storm and into literal hell. Ooh, holy Jonesy. Oh, bro, I hate you. I at I at I hate you. 
Uh, epic? Are my eyes playing tricks on me? <laughs> what is that? Warning, warning, crazy lore alert. Here at the Daily Bugle, we've seen a bunch of changes since the Seven have actually taken over this location, but one of the craziest changes. Yo, whose flag is this? Oh, we know exactly whose flag this is. This is the Ghost Agency. The Ghost Agency was a group all the way back in our Chapter 2 game and was introduced in Chapter 2 of Season 2. Midas was the head of the Ghost Agency, and he led the fight against the Chaos Agent, who ran the Chaos Agency. Midas and the Chaos Agent were trying to recruit players to their respectable teams, but ultimately Ultimately, Midas had secret plans to launch the Doomsday device and try and end the storm forever. The flag of the Ghost Agency and the symbol of Midas just so happens to be the same flag, the same symbol that has just appeared in our Chapter 3 for tonight's game. Holy Jonesy, dude, we haven't seen this logo in quite some time. I mean, it's literally been years, right? Literally? Literally? Hello, I'm by myself in a room. Hello? Oh, we know this location was taken over by the Seven, as the Seven soldiers are here, very unpolitely walking past me. Look where you're going next time. This is the Seven. This is the Foundation. And all the other members of the Seven. What has the Ghost Agency got to do with it? Well, let me tell you. It would seem that the Ghost Agency Midas and his team are actually working with the members of the Seven. With Midas's book actually found in our Fortnite's game, players have suspected that Midas has actually been on this island for quite some time. We also know that Midas actually wanted to stop the storm by creating a device that would hold it back. The storm resetting is a device made by the Imagined Order. So it would seem that the Seven and Midas's ghost agency are actually working towards a similar cause. There has been theories that Midas himself is one of the members of the Seven. Literally, Midas being one of the members of the Seven would make a lot of sense, but we haven't quite seen the full evidence to prove this. But now, with the ghost agency flag appearing at the Daily Bugle, players are actually starting to believe that Midas and the Seven are now officially working together in a strategical battle to destroy the Imagined Order. <laughs> The way you're going next time, huh? Is it actually possible that the biggest law change in Fortnite's history has just been made a reality? The Ghost Agency and the Seven are actually teaming against the Imagined Order. Hey, beep beep coming through. Hey, bro, can you stop shooting, bro? Hey, bro. Holy joke. See what they be doing at it? That's my bus right there. Come on, man. Hey, I'm gonna have to say it because I know everyone else is thinking it. Yo, my loadout is garbage, bro. <laughs> Yo, my loadout be looking like a black and white photo. Oh, if in doubt, blast them out. Oh, homie, you were looking the wrong way, dog. Give me them colors. Laser. Dog. My goodness, man. I didn't stand a gosh darn chance, bro. There's a Columbo 2.0 coming to the game. Indiana Jones, which one are you most excited for? Let me know in the comment section below. Post for the creator code on screen right now. Let me know what you think about everything we've talked about in today's video. Is there anything we've missed? Anything we need to talk about? Hey, let me know. Oh, and if you like this video, you're gonna love this video that is on screen right now. Okay, guys, I'm gonna catch you on the next crazy season two of Fortnite's video. Thanks, guys. Peace.